guys, this is Bhavya and welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing a smoky eye makeup for office. This one is going to be a little subtle, sober and nice. So yeah, to begin with, I'm going to apply this moisturizer by Plum. This is a really good moisturizer for oily skin and very light. I think the lighting is not good. I better shift. Yeah, now I feel the lighting is quite good and even on my face. So after applying moisturizer, I'm going to go ahead with foundation. This one is by Nykaa, Nykaa Skin Genius Foundation in the shade Pure Ivory. I'm just going to take it on this plate, dot it all over my face and blend with the beauty blender. Don't forget your neck. I'm going to take a little more for the coverage. Next, I'm going to apply concealer and for that I'm using Miss Clear Full Coverage Concealer. This is a really nice concealer with full coverage. I'm just going to take it a little bit on spoolie, put it on the plate, drop some almond oil so that the concealer becomes a little thin and uh, spreads evenly. What is wrong with my hair? Just going to mix it and apply it under my eyes. around my mouth to hide pigmentation. Now with the beauty blender, I'm going to blend everything in. Whatever is left on the sponge, I'm going to apply it on my eyelids so that I get a nice base. Once that's done, I'm going to take this pressed powder by Sugar Cosmetics and with the help of a brush, I'm going to push it so that my concealer sets in. I'm going to even apply it around my mouth and if you feel your face is too shiny you can always take a matte powder, pressed powder and apply it all over the face so that you can get rid of the shine. Now I'm going to define my eyebrows using Palladio eyebrow pencil. This one has a brush and it is a really nice thing. I used this once and I really liked it. But the product is really soft, like if you put a bit pressure, it breaks, so yeah, one needs to be careful. Next, I'm going to be taking Maybelline Brow Pomade to tame my eyebrow hair, which is by the way very less. Next, I'm going to be taking this Kajal by Nykaa. This is I Am Black Kajal. I draw it like an eyeliner and then smudge it. really like this kajal too. When you smudge it, remember to push it upwards so that you get that depth effect like from black to it's going a little lighter and you know the gradient effect that actually gives the effect of a smoky eye. I'm going to repeat the same thing on the other eye. Whatever is left on the bud, I'm gonna just apply it halfway through my lower lashes. Make sure everything is blended, the kajal is blended and there are no harsh lines. Smoky eyes is all about being blended and smooth. And now I'm going to take my Glam Chiselit palette and from here I'm going to take a bronzer, apply it all over my eyelid and halfway through my lower lashes as well. The reason why I am not taking chocolate brown and going for bronzer because I want it to be subtle. I don't want it to just pop up and uh, this way it'll look more natural you know now I'm going to give some really nice curl to my eyelashes and pop on some mascara the mascara that I'm using is by essence it is called the get big eyelashes lashes get big lashes mascara now I'll be using the same palette highlighter blush and contour and complete the face so I'm gonna first contour you can always leave contouring if you want. It's just an optional step. Now some blush. I like to apply it on my nose and chin also. I don't know, just like the look. And for lipstick, I'm taking this color bar in the shade Demore. Just going to take it here. I feel smudged lips look much more 
sleek. So guys, this is the finished and the complete look. I hope you like this makeup. Like this video, share this video, comment your views and I'm going to see you soon in my next video. Till then, bye. Thank <laughs> you.